Alright ladies and gentlemen, if you read the name of the video or if you just clicked it, if you didn't click on it, in that case we're going to play the uh, base off of us on top of the box, guess what's in the box. And in this case it's in a different mode, here is the ziplock for the for the parts to do the other modes. Alright, so this is going to be a full unboxing, I'm going to be opening the brown box, I'm going to be opening the packaging, I'm going to be getting the stuff out of the packaging. And Chris here has been looking forward to this every bit as much as I have. I have, ever since I started this, I have been wanting this for so long. And what I found on this stuff, oh yeah. That's on my, uh, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh no, that big thing standing on my room. Oh my God. We got the paper, paper. And I hear the stuff that says, and uh. work it, Chris. Work it. Come on. Come on. There you go. Give me. Ugh. All right. Boy, that's the best thing ever. The bubble wrap. Is there more junkyard Chris scarfing? Yeah. Oh yeah. You know what I want. Kinda. Yes. I have done it. Oh, nice. Here we have the side of the packaging showing Carnifax in its robot mode. And then we, with the guns out on, well, one of the guns out on his uh, chest plate, and of course he's got his shield, he's got his gun. On the side of the packaging we've got the gun wrapping around coming down here. A uh, close up of the uh, alternate head for Carnifax. Yay! Nope, same head. But the damaged eye from the uh, comic. And then we got here the obligatory photo shots. It does this, that, and the other thing, and the other thing, and the other thing, and the other thing, and the other thing. Does the poses, can the wait of you, can look at you, can hold the gun, can do the base, can do the plane, can do the tank, can do this pose here with the robot mode, can do that pose with the robot mode, can do this mode here and with the plane and the tank. Out. And then two faces syndrome. Please don't be under 16, have this. <laughs> And then uh, Mastermind Creations logo, and then of course on the bottom, we got the, warning, please don't need anything in this box, it's not good for you. Oh, yeah. Then we got the blah, 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 the barcode. Made in China, <laughs> R17 Carnifax reformatted. And then we got the in love with alternative shade of purple. I got love with this nice shade That's of purple. That's brown, you liar. R17 Car Carnifax Gladiator. With the same, close up of the face, reformatted. And now that we are done the ceremony of showing off the box, yeah. Now we will give the tape a little easily, a little, you know, a bit of leverage. We got foam! Yes, foam inside the box. Not the plastic, and not the cardboard, but foam packaging. I'll, I'll be like Vanna White. <laughs> uh, oh, sweet, a card. And now what do we got in? Oh, yes. Now what do we have in this? I that. <laughs> We've got the very good high quality Carnifax's uh, reformatted or obligatory product card. 17 Carnifax Gladiator. We've got textbook speech, intelligence, strength, intelligence, speed, endurance. Which I'll take. Cast, courage, firepower, skill, and the two vehicle modes. Uh, obligatory photo here of the artwork. This is actually a nice card. I wish I got a poster of this instead. Huh. Which Chris here will enjoy the, uh, will enjoy that. Oh, it's plastic this time, nice. Yeah, we have all of it. And then we got, we got the obligatory plastic. Really high endurance. And then we got here the instructions. With the comic at the beginning, which oh. Master Mind Creation's very good at doing. Yeah, Carnifax sitting in his throne with a little robot servant serving him drinks. <laughs> there he is going, hey guys. They got there, uh, him talking with each other with the other uh, available from Mastermind Creations. We got here, you know, people. We got enough. We got them in vehicle mode. And of course, once you get through, you shut your book, you flip your book over, and then you've got your instructions. You suck. Okay, now. 
the real banana. Now for what you're here for. Thanks. Which this is in robot mode, so we're going to quickly cut the camera off, and then I want to basically transform my overlord into its robot mode, and then we'll get into this packaging here real quick. All right, got uh, overlord in its robot mode. Now let's get out. Let's get to the package of Carnifex. Face the third head. Here is here is the damaged eye head. I don't know how it's going to show up on our camera since we need to get we need to get us a better camera. And then we got here the kind of fox gun. Da, 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 pow, 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 pow. We got here the jet Carnifex jet shield. Oh, nice. And swords with the, with the changeable handles. Let's see. I have taken over for now. And we got a foot, which also means the tank for for Carnifex. All right, there we go. <laughs> One foot down does not stand. Yep. We got here the the other foot. Other foot, which also makes up the tank. Oh, nice. Oh, best part about the tank. The wheels move. Yep. Yeah, I'm loosening them up. There you go. Now. They just don't roll good. What I understand, but. You have to exercise them a bit, that's why. I'm sorry, YouTube. Another, another good. This one is a bit, bit very tight. There we go. But you know how it is when you get, sometimes no, these new transformers are just a little stiff when you get them. All right. Decepticrace. There we go. And now, Got the got the top part of the kind of facts which makes up the jet. I like his hands. I'm gonna put the other leg on. No. No. I need that. Let's see if it'll fit in the recycling. There we go. Hey, well. <laughs> wow, old school is bigger than new school. Surprisingly, we still got attached to pieces. Hi, baby. You don't have Carnifex without the man, without the gun and the piece. All right, so ah, okay. The gun's very significant in different ways. Um. Pull this off, pull this off. Part in tank mode. Well, if you're gonna be a gun, you have to have a handle. Where's the handle? You have to transform it into the handle, it's right now in the tank, tank it's like mode. It's in the tank turret mode. Okay. But I'm not surprised those packs in the tank turret mode and not in the. Not. There it is. Jet. <sighs> This is not, this ain't, this ain't who he's intending to represent without the gun. Overlord. Of course, it's using the uh, arbit arbitrary side peg system, which was invented for the masterpiece line, instead of using the slot system that the newer ones have started using. Where's his Decepticon logo? That's my creations, not Hasbro, not Chikara. Oh, it's not, it's neither. Mm -hmm. Hence why no Decepticon logo. Because this is Carn, this is, this is Carnifax Overlord, not Overlord. Which this is the IDW version representation of Overlord. And now, uh, Basically, it's just a ball joint to pop, to swap the heads, but I'm probably not going to use the broken eye. 
I did order the upgrade kit, so I will be able to do the do the Power Masters if I want to. Chest turret. I need to figure out it. Okay. That's that one. Where is this one? So I'm gonna put it down the gun. <laughs> okay, so I just have to grab it and pull it down. Okay. Doris. Korea. Crispy Okay, is this the this I do believe yes it looks like we've got old school, which mind you my overload is getting really worn out. In fact I can't even plug him into the chest and the cover for that one broke off anyhow. And we got the Carnifax here next to it. I'm gonna order it next week. Now this is apparently, I believe this is the first run Carnifax and not the second run Carnifax. The second run Carnifax actually comes with a silver sword and I didn't see that anywhere in my packaging. So. No, it's, there's nothing even in there. Yeah, so. It would have been in the styrofoam. Yeah. So this is apparently the first run Carnifax, which is okay. I, the new sword just looks like it's just more, uh, more bling <laughs> to me. So basically, to tell you, let you all know the rundown for how I'm going to be doing this review is the next video will be an actual proper articulation examination of Carnifax and comparisons with classic G1 Overlord, and it will have the beginning intro by Mascot with closing gag, and then I'll have a separate video transforming Carnifax to whatever mode and instructions follows from the robot mode and then a review on that mode with the beginning and end gags as well. And then it will be transformation again. And whichever, wherever the jet mode ends up, I will try to do the combo jet and tank mode in the same video to get that done. So that's basically it. I hope you get look forward, you guys look forward to that's big. And since that overlord has got a power match on the shoulder, I'll put this one there. Oh yeah, then when the, uh, then with the upgrade kit rest for this, I'll do just cut to each mode in the same video without beginning or ending gag with the Power Masters for Carnifex when that upgrade arrives. Thank, thank you for watching. Uh, to our Ninja viewers who are regular watchers but don't subscribe, thank you. To our subscribers, a huge thank you. To our... Uh, I told you to our okay. notification squad, a huge thank you, and to our Patreon, a really big thank you to you as well. And as always, peace out. You got something big to look forward to. Cornufaxi.